Hello all and welcome to tonight's Torah portion. Before I get started, I'm going to say a blessing. Blessed art thou, Adonai, the King of the universe, who has sanctified us with his commandments, commanded us, and grossed us with the words of Torah. Please, Adonai, Eleni. Sing the words of your Torah in our mouths and in the mouths of all your people, Israel. May we and your offspring, the offspring of your people, the house of Israel. May we all together know your name and study your Torah for sake of fulfilling your desire. Blessed are you, Adonai, who teaches Torah to his people, Israel. Blessed are you, Adonai Elihun, you king of the universe, who chose us from all the nations and gave us the Torah. Blessed are you, Adonai, give us the Torah. May Adonai bless you and keep watch over you. May Adonai make his presence in London. You may be kind to you. May Adonai bestow favor on you and grant you peace. We have the last three little reads from Vayikra today. Uh, I know some of you are starting the next Torah portion, but uh, I do mind by the lunar cycle so my week still has uh, my week still has two more days before it rolls over so yeah uh, Nick can you hit F11 please There we go. Now, now do it. There it goes. Okay. All right. Yeah. There's that. <laughs> Our first read is Romans eight one through thirteen. There is therefore no now no condemnation for those who are in Yeshua Hamashiach, for the law of the Spirit of life has set you free in Yeshua Hamashiach from the law of sin and death. For Elohim has done what the law weakened by the flesh could not do, by sending his own son for the likeliness Oh sorry, in the likeness of sinful flesh and for sin, he condemned sin to the flesh, in order that the righteous requirement of the law might be fulfilled in us who walk not according to the flesh, but according to the spirit, for those who live according to the flesh set their minds on things of the flesh, but those who live according to the spirit set their minds on are things of the spirit. For to set the mind on the flesh is death, but to set the mind on the spirit is life and peace. For the mind that has set on flesh is hostile to Elohim, and for it does not submit to Elohim's law. Indeed, it cannot, for those who are in the flesh cannot please Elohim. Really? You're going to go up? You, however, are not in the flesh, but in spirit. If, in fact, the spirit of Elohim dwells in you, anyone who does not have the spirit of HaMashiach does not belong to him. But if HaMashiach is in you, although the body is dead because of sin, the spirit of, if, is life because of righteousness. If the spirit of him who raised Yeshua from the dead dwells in you, he will raise Yesh He who raised Yeshua HaMashiach from the dead will also give life to your mortal bodies through spirit who dwells in you. Come on, stop bouncing. So then, brothers, we are debtors, not to the flesh, to live according to the flesh. For if you live according to the flesh, you will die. But if you live by the spirit, you put to death the deeds of the body. You will live. Hebrews 10, 1 through 18. For since a law has but a shadow of the good things to come instead of the true form of the realities. It can ne never, by the same sacrifice that are continually offered every year, make perfect those who draw near. Otherwise, would they not have ceased to be offered, since the worshippers, having once been cleansed, would no longer have any consciousness of sins. But in these sacrifices there is a reminder of sins every year, for it is impossible for the blood of bulls <coughs> and goats to take away sins. Consequently, when Hamashiach came into the world, he said, Sacrifices and offerings you have not desired, but a body you have you but a body have you prepared for me, and burnt offerings and sin offerings. You have taken no pleasure. Then I said, Behold, I will come to do your will, O Elohim, as it is written of me in the scroll of the book.
When he said above, you have neither desired nor taken pleasure in sacrifices, offering, burnt offerings, sin offerings, these are offered according to the law. But he added, Behold, I have come to do your will. He does away with the first in order to establish the second. And by the will we have sanctified through the offering of the body of Yeshua HaMashiach once and for all. And every priest stands daily at his service offering repeated lead of same sacrifices which can never take away sins. But when HaMashiach had offered for all time a single sacrifice for sins, he sat down at the right hand of Elohim waiting from the time and from that time until his enemy should be made a footstool for his feet. For by a single offering he has perfected for all time those who are being sanctified. And the Holy Spirit also builds, bears witness to us at, for after say, <coughs> saying this is a covenant that I will make with them. After those days declares the Lord, I will put my laws on their hearts and write them on their minds. Then he adds, I, rem I will remember their sins and their lawless deeds no more. Where there is forgiveness of these, there is no longer any offering for sin. Hebrews 13.10-16 We have an altar from which those who serve the tent have no right to eat. For the bodies of those animals whose blood is brought into the holy place by the high priest as an offering for sin are burned outside the camp. So Yeshua also suffered outside the main gate in order to sanctify the people through his own blood. Therefore let us go to him outside the camp and bear the reproach he endured. For how are we for here we have no lasting city, but we seek the city that is to come. Through him let us continually offer a sacrifice to praise of praise to Elohim, that is the fruit of lips that acknowledge his name. Do not neglect to do good and to share what you have, for such sacrifices are pleasing to Elohim. <coughs> Blessed art thou, Adonai Eloheinu, King of the universe, who gives the Torah of truth instead of lasting life in our midst. Blessed art thou, Adonai, giver of the Torah, Brukhata Adonai Eloheinu, Malach Alom, Ashna, Tal, Lenu, Tredi, Met, Baishi, Elom, Nata, Betikinu, Brukhata Adonai, Natina, Torah. Sorry about all that noise, my, uh, yeah.